Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. You can use the fixed asset item list to track your individual fixed assets. You can use this list to enter information about the purchase price of an asset, its purchase date, and whether the asset was new or used at purchase. You can also enter the asset's sale price if you decide to sell the asset at a later point in time. To open this list, select Lists from the menu bar, and then choose the Fixed Asset Item List command. To add a fixed asset item, click the Item button in the lower left corner of this list, and select the New command from the pop-up menu that appears. That will then launch the New Item window. Here you can enter the asset information that you wish to record within this screen, and then click the OK button when you're finished. Also note that there are custom fields available for your fixed asset list. You can create up to five custom fields, just as you would create custom fields within the item list. However, you must be in single user mode in order to do this. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.